What's going on, everybody? Connor Fields here with my man Bryce Betts Yo. and uh, Max Cairns. And today we are going to play a little BMX Jeopardy. And I encourage all you young riders at home, know your BMX history. I see way too many kids out there who don't know anything about the past pros, the past amateurs, or anything about the history of the sport. So today, Bryce and I are going to go against each other and we're going to test our knowledge of the history of the sport and uh, see what happens. Max is going to host it. I'm the host. We have a Max Trebek over here <laughs> and uh, we're going to play a little BMX Jeopardy. So we'll let Max introduce the different topics that we have up here and uh, yeah, and the rules and we'll get going. Yeah, so I'm Max, the host. Uh, we have five categories here, each uh, different amount of points, starting 200 to 1,000. We have year they started, the company or the product, UCI rules, uh, the first sponsor of a pro, uh, USA BMX history, and we have World Cup and World Champ history. All right, so who's going first? I'm gonna do first sponsor for 800. So for 800, oh, this is gonna be a, hopefully an easy one for you. Donnie Robinson. First pro sponsor is what I did. Pro? Pro sponsor. Avet. Nope. Powerlight. Oh! I had a chance to steal, <laughs> but he ruined it, so. He was a pro on Powerlight. Are you sure? It's Wikipedia, bro. There's no I'm, way I'm because. I'm pretty sure he wasn't. He was in fly gear, call I Donnie. remember. Call Donnie. I'm gonna call Donnie right <laughs> now. <laughs> he actually texted me just now. <laughs> like, literally, when I was here, I have call, call the Don. Because I'm pretty sure it was Avent. I was gonna guess Avent. I got Donnie Robinson <laughs> calling right now. Someone needs to update his Wikipedia page. He was a pro. Hey, um, so I got your text about the design stuff. I'm gonna finish it today. <laughs> but uh, I'm more, doing a- More importantly, Don. I'm with Connor. We're doing a BMX trivia video. And uh, I guessed it correctly saying your first pro sponsor was Avent, but Max Cairns, the host, thinks it was Powerlight. I just want you to confirm that it was Avent. Well, what's the question? Who was the first, what was your first professional bike sponsor? Yeah, because you were in the fly gear. With yeah. The, you were in so the, from 95 to 2001, he wasn't pro? No. When no. did What year did you turn pro? Definitely wasn't Powerlight because that's who I left. That's why like, I didn't stay with them because they just went out of business. <laughs> <laughs> I will give you the 800 points. Uh, and that's Jane. Max's first mulligan. Yep. All right, I'll go next. Uh, we'll keep it on the first pro sponsor, but I'll go for the 1,000. 1,000? The Wade Boots. I know he wrote for Trek, but I don't know if that was his first one. I'm gonna be guessing out of left field here. Dingo. Bruce Trek. Oh, I went too, did I try to <laughs> <laughs> right. You're supposed to be able to steal. Yeah. All right, stealing. I messed up too though, I messed uh, up. Too. Stealing starts next round. <laughs> All right, you're up. Okay, I'm going to go USA BMX history for 800. Don't say the answer this time of year. Yeah, I won't say the answer. <laughs> Who won the 2009 national title for Elite? In what? Uh, what? Like, so the, like the actual national title, not the USA BMX title. The USA Cycling National title. USA Cycling National title. Jason Rogers. Yep. Mic drop. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, I'm going to go first pro sponsor, 600. The whole podium, I'm pretty sure was. Was it Jason, Donnie, and Nick? I don't remember. Damn. Where was it? DeSoto. DeSoto. There we go. I won um, 15 boys. <laughs> <laughs> Baba Harris. Red line. <laughs> Red line. Yep. Oh, Donnie. I thought you said the answer. That's like I'm on the board. <laughs> on the board. All right. There we go. Right, you're halfway to me. Um, Good math. <laughs> Ooh, you really started scares me, World Cup. I'm gonna go first pro sponsor 400. John Purse. The Jackal was on Redline. 
First pro sponsor? No. Mongoose? GHP. No. That was way later. <laughs> what was it? You want to guess one more round? Uh... Brand's no longer around. <laughs> if that narrows it down, anything. Uh, <laughs> which thousand bike brand is it? <laughs> um, It'd be easier if they were around. Uh, uh, Kruppi. They're still around. Oh, <laughs> uh, what was Diamond it? Diamondback. MCS. Oh, okay. MCS. Brian Felt. It's not Brian. That one's a garbage. <laughs> I'll go USA History for 1,000. Who won the last NBL title for in elite? Oh, it was uh, someone random, right? Oh, I think I'm going to be wrong. Matt Kelty. Boom. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Matt, that was a like Kovacci? Yeah, Matt Kelty and Kovacci. Yeah, that was a big one. That was, uh, I didn't know that was. Maris won the year before. Yeah, yeah Maris won 09. And then <laughs> Kelty, or 9 and 10, and Kelty won 11, and that was mm. it. Dang. You're right. That was a big, that was a big <laughs> one right there. Um, I'm going to do a year they started, 800. Year they started, 800. <laughs> what year did Speedco restart? Like, with Betcher? Mm-hmm. 2014? 2015. 2015. <laughs> <laughs> I was just going to guess one. <laughs> one whatever it did. All right, I'll go... Um, I'm gonna go big. I'm just gonna try to get some points. World Cup and World Championships for a G. World Cup and World Championships for an ABA win. <laughs> <laughs> this is a 20 at 20 podcast question. That's my podcast where I have conversations with industry leaders about what advice they give their 20 year old selves. And Connor uh, was episode number five, so definitely check that link down below if you listen to the podcast. I'll put it in the bio. Um, what, what, oh, so with that, we both answer the question. Both answer the question. So this is, there's a list of riders, there's 10 of them, and the person with wins. the most wins. So, rider to win a world championships, but not receive any other medal. So, he won the worlds, and then hasn't received a silver or a bronze. At the Olympics. At, no, at the world championships. Oh, won a worlds, but never been on a podium other than the win. Yeah. Okay. This cruiser cup? Just elite men, no cruiser. <laughs> Okay. I can't believe it's ten. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I was shocked. <laughs> can't even name ten. <laughs> I got four as well. I'm like looking at your trophies hoping there's someone on <laughs> <laughs> Do we get points off if they're like not? Well that'll be the tiebreaker. Alright. I'm going people, I don't even know if they're right, so I'm gonna draw a line and then just start writing. <laughs> you know who never won a world title? Me. Who should have won a world title? <laughs> Stumpy. Yeah. Randy Stumphauser. Dude, he's even going fast in 09. Yeah. He won a lot of cruiser world titles. Yeah, he did. He won like 12 of those things. <laughs> I shouldn't have ever won a world title. <laughs> I never, I never won one either. Alright, I got my I got my guess for 10. Okay, let me put one more down. <clears throat> Wait, no, not including girls, right? Just men? Just men. Okay. What about time trials? No. <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> they don't count. Ask you as they cycling. All right, are you ready? Wait, no, no, let me just write one name. I'm trying to think of someone. Oh. Did Gary else have a race? <laughs> oh, I should have copied one of your answers. I just saw it. I just saw it. I just fucking blew it. Yeah, I know exactly who you saw it. Yeah. I'm not gonna say. I would know though. Um, I'm just gonna say him because he's my favorite old school pro. Okay, so um, we'll read it. We'll, we'll, do you want to read it? Or how do you want to? How do you want to go? So you give me. Okay, so the ones I know for sure, I got Tuan. Yep. Corbin. Yep. Sam. Yep. Liam. Yep. Donnie. Yep. Javier. Yep. Oh, like Kyle. Yep. yep. So those are the seven that I knew for sure. Mm -hmm. The one that I saw on his that I don't get points for is Warwick. Mm -hmm. That I should have had. So that's eight. I should have had eight. Yeah. Uh, my guess is we're Deville. No, he, he got him. Um, he got uh, a couple of other medals. Have okay. you won a World Cup? Yeah, he put Kristoff up in like '97 or something. Like that, uh, one of years. Dale Holmes. No, he got a bronze. He got a bronze or Allier. Yep. Yeah. So I got nine of the ten. You got eight. Well, you just yeah, added numbers that you copied off eight. of me. You got eight. I got eight. Okay, I got Javier Colombo. Mm -hmm. Donnie Robinson. Yep. Yeah. Liam Phillips. Yep. Yeah. Maris. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, no, 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 no Maris. Maris got silver in eleven. Oh, oh yeah. 
Bubba Harris? No, Bauer got other medals. Oh, four. Mm -hmm. Warwick? Yep. Kyle? Yep. Danny Nelson? No. Oh, I thought. Here's a 10th that we didn't get. Hang on, it might be my guy. Oh, who is it? So Dale got a podium. He told me he was always good at Worlds. I shouldn't have <laughs> Hang on, I, I hope this is true. Terry T. <laughs> <laughs> no, he, my wasn't, favorite he wasn't UCI. Give, it, give us a hint, what country was the guy in the last American. Time? It was early. Oh, yeah, it would have been early. Oh, man. Purse. Purse. <laughs> Should have done it. I got five. How many right. did you get? I got eight. eight. And so you got the thousand. That's the thousand. Cute. Boom. Put that with you. All right. You're up. Um, I'm going here. They started a thousand. <laughs> the first Haro BMX bike. <laughs> it's for a thousand, so... People I should know, I should know Bob Hart. 84. <laughs> what do you think? 83. What do you think? 86. 77. Go back to you. Connor's been the closest so far. We don't get the points. <laughs> we lose. <laughs> what was it? 82. 82. Alright. I'm pretty sure 84 is closer than 7. I'll go UCI. <laughs> I'll go UCI rules. No, he said 83. <laughs> he said 83. I'll go UCI rules for a thousand. Um, on the cadence, the last beat. How it extends? How long does that last for? <laughs> <laughs> Two point four seconds. What do you think, Bryce? One point three. Longer. You go. Want to go again? Three seconds. So it's lower. Bryce, you're up. Point seven. Hi. Right. Two point five seconds. Dude, it's under one point five. What is it? You don't just hear. Boo! 2.25. Oh, I was close. That's <laughs> a two hey, that's the distance from the first beep to the last beep. No. The wait, did you these are the dead ones, right? Yeah. yeah. Um, the mind. last the last beep goes for 2.25 seconds. It goes 0.6, points uh, 0.6 on, 0.6 off, 0.6 on, 0.6 off, <laughs> and then 2.25 uh, seconds. Moral of the story is go on the first beep. <laughs> <laughs> if, 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 you, if you're 0.6 off, you're late. Uh, um I'll go World Cup and World Champs for 800 bucks. So 2010 was the last time they ran the Elite Cruiser World Championships. Mm -hmm. Who won? I was supposed to be in that Junior Cruiser explosion, but Renato Rosende <laughs> won Elite Cruiser. Renato Rosende won. Shout out Renato, I know he's watching. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Ross, going you first pro sponsor, 200. I always remember these because I love jersey designs. <laughs> Carl Bennett. Nerve. ORP. Standard ORP. That's the easiest question you have. <laughs> <laughs> that, was la that was the last one, too. Any kids out there don't know Kyle Bennett is, spend the next hour on YouTube. <laughs> Look, Look for up. the bump jump into the first turn. <laughs> and Orlando O2. Every pro knows about that. All right. Um, I think you're up. Or no, you just went. I I'll do in. USA BMX history for 600 bucks. 20 at 20 question. Let's do it. Uh, which one was it? USA BMX? Yeah. 20 at 20. So... In 1987, oh, gosh. <laughs> Mike King won the amateur title. Mm. What did he win? He won two things. Name them. <laughs> he probably won like a trans and yacht. <laughs> <laughs> How did you answer so fast? I just guess. I don't even know what to guess. What was cool in the 80s? <laughs> An ET replica? <laughs> <laughs> Heavy metal, I don't know. Alright, what did you put? I had a car and a motorcycle. I had a car and a guitar. Rhymes. They won a boat and a motorbike. Oh, I got one! I got one! So do I get it? Cut in half. Do yeah, I get, get half. I get 300 points? So he, yeah, he got a $14,500 boat and oh a 1600 God. How much is that today, too? That's like... And a $1,600 um, motorbike. Let's put this place. in perspective. When I won the USA BMX <laughs> Pro Town in 2017, I got a bike stand <laughs> and a set of tools I sold on eBay for $120. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm going year they started 600. Yes, BMX. My teammate Colby Kent had some Yes BMX forks on when I was in like 2001. This will well, this was the first Yes BMX frame. Oh, so Max doesn't even know he doesn't even know his history. Yeah, I, I was on BMX I, Mania. That was like first Yes BMX frame at this date. Okay, well I can guarantee that they made forks in 2000. <laughs> <laughs> um. Man, when was Trent on that banana frame? <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
I'm going 0-9. What do you think? 10. One more guess. 11? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think your shirt was on the banana frame for 12. <laughs> I raised them then. Yeah. Yeah. Did you smoke it? No. Uh, <laughs> Alright, I'll go uh, UCI, make up your rules at 800. 20-20. God, he's going to get in trouble. That's alright. So, when you're racing, there's five different types of penalties you can receive. <laughs> there are? List, list the penalties. Okay. Like, the abbreviations you can get for them? Well, yeah, so like, on, on track you can get, you can start with, there's like a, yeah. a scale from yeah. least to biggest. Like these? No, like penalty. Like That's five? Yeah, there's five. You can cut white lines. You can do anything, and you don't get penalized. But I've never I seen. You, I think if you start swearing at people, and this is the sort of like, mm. like if you, or like, you can get penalized for not racking up in the right gate and refusing to move. That's the, that's the reason to get penalized. I was reading. I'm gonna people. try that. <laughs> Are you ready? Yeah. What do you have? I have warning. Mm -hmm. Last in your race, plus two. Disqualified. Ban. Lifetime ban. I have monetary. I thought maybe they could take your purse money. <laughs> Qualification. Like, like, can they disqualify you, I think? Yeah. They could dock your positioning. Um, and then they can give you a ban. And they could also... I, I couldn't even think of other things, so I said time. Like, they could add three seconds. Do <laughs> <laughs> you race time? Well, what's the answer? So... I'll read the answers and then we can sort of work out which one is which. <laughs> so you, you, you start with an official warning. Okay, I, okay, I don't have that. And then you get releg like a relegation. Minus plus two. And then you get disqualified. Because okay, so that's position and disqualification yep. for me. Disqualification, removal from the venue, and suspension. So what did you have? I only got two things right. Yeah, so you had monetary and time ban. So I had four. I had the warning, yeah. last DQ, ban. So I'll take that one. 800, like, yeah, 800 for me. Okay. All right, Bryce. This one's falling off, so I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna be good and pick USA it. BMX history for 200. It's gonna be rough for 200, but at the time, 200 was just garbage. Count that in ORP. <laughs> First amateur to win back-to-back -back titles. Oh, I should know this because Josh Joey was like my dude, and he won it, and it was a big deal because not many have. I'm gonna guess Ronnie Anderson. I think, yeah, Richie Anderson, sorry. Guys. <laughs> that's his brother. That, that, we'll give you credit for that. You deserve that. <laughs> I knew it was one of the Andersons. Yeah, you get that one. Take I thought it. that might have been the same guy. That's just like a nickname or something. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, you Close enough. That. His brother. You take that. <laughs> All right, let's finish USCB makes history up in 400. Who has the most cruiser titles? Randy Stumphauser. Boom. <laughs> Easy money. <laughs> that dude made probably 500K in his career on cruiser. <laughs> just on he cruiser. He won a lot of... You see our world he won a lot of cruise races, <laughs> and he's a stand-up dude. If any of you kids out there do not know who Randy Stumphauser is, spend the next hour on YouTube after watching Kyle <laughs> Bennett. Stumpy. Okay, um, I'm going near they started for 400. For 400? S squared, what time, when did they make their first frame? Okay, I, I, I vividly remember the like giant rig at Grands, so I was definitely there. Which is good. Because that helps me. 2011. I feel like I guessed 2011 for everything. I was going to guess 2011, so I'll say 2010. 2012. 2012. Well, no, because Josh Myers was riding 2012 trials, and S squared was very established. Oh, what year did I guess first? What year did you guess? You guess. I'm guessing 2009. Yep. There you go. 400 for you. All right, let's finish up the year they started for 200. So Sins came out and changed the game. Oh yeah, they did. With the twenty mil fork. I was running those things. Nick Kohler, I think he's one of the first. Testers. He was the first one that was on the BMX Mania website when I went through it. <laughs> what year was that? When Nick Kohler first got his S squared forks, not S squared, um, Sins forks. Okay, I can do this. I can do this. It's, it's uh, either either oh seven. Not even close. Because I was in Junior Devo. Stone of emotion. I don't know. You tell me. Is, is that your final no, answer? No, it's not. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. <laughs> no, you're yeah, also <laughs> the price. No, I'm, you said 07. No. What do you mean asking <laughs> questions like, oh, yes or no? Okay. I'm thinking out loud. I was in Junior Devo, so I wasn't Junior. I was Junior in 2012. He was Junior in 20... 2013. 2013. I was Junior in 2013. No. 2008. 
No. Ten. Yeah. I swear I run the, I was running those things in 09. When I was when I was riding for free agent, I was running since works. Yeah, yeah, but they weren't twenty mil. Oh. Those were popular though. God. Yeah. Alright. With the big so That was a big deal. All right. You had to use a car wrench to <laughs> <then come up. laughs> Okay, um I'm going World Cup four hundred. World Cup and World Championship. So who won the first UCI World Championship? Ninety seven? It was ninety six. I was close. Dude, I have no clue. I was one year old. <laughs> I was just being born. Do they even have clip pedals then? I don't think so. <laughs> Dobby Max was way better than man. <laughs> way <laughs> better <laughs> back then. <laughs> Flat. I'm going Boston Beaver. Here you go. Person. You're on Eric the, Roop. <laughs> you were on the right path before though. Who, me or him? You, with what you're saying. What, purse? With like the... Who hates the homes? Brian England. He passed Stumpy in the second last <laughs> turn. Oh, yeah. Put flat him right pedal. Yeah, That's yeah, what I thought. I thought yeah, you yeah, yeah, no, 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 flat pedal. No, no, no. Yeah, like, yeah. like, he's on it. I thought he went to yeah. Kentucky. He won too. Mm. Oh. Alright, uh, let's finish this one off. World Cup, World Champ 600. 2020. Let's do it. So, there's three athletes. Male and female. Who has the most World Championship medals? Dominic Daniels. They all tied for the same amount? World Championship, yeah. Bronze. Do you count time trials? Gold. I do not count, count time bronze? trials. count bronze? Time trials count, I'm telling you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not counting any time trials. <laughs> did you count cruiser world titles earlier? Did junior, did junior titles count? Junior titles do not count. So just elite? Elite, male and female, who has the most medals. He said elite and girls. So I know the number. Old. The number six. But I... I, I know one for sure, but I know the other two, I just am guessing on them. I'm just trying to think of a girl. You made me like go back and double check my answers reading this, but I'm all good. Did Shanazi never win a world? She won seven. She won seven and nine. Uh, oh, she, was like, she was like James Stewart. She had won her last. Um, <laughs> I know Joris has six, yeah. and that's the number. The other two that I'm going to guess is Elise and Mariana. It's not right. So I knew Joris, and then I guessed Maris and Sam. No, Sam's only got two because he has. Mm -hmm. he, remember, he was one. He won, yeah. or he didn't get any other medals. So Joris is right. Is Elise or Mariana right? No. Oh. So you both hey, have whoa. one. We're back. So you a back tiebreaker. Tiebreaker. We can each guess one person. Is a guy or a girl? Well, there's a guy and a girl. Uh. There's two more. We're gonna have the same person. <laughs> Say it on three. One, two, three. Stumpy. Caroline. Stumpy. Yeah! <laughs> Stumpy. Do you count? You didn't count mountain bike? <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure mountain bike, she got six. So yeah. Yeah. I'll take that. 600. Who's the Gabriel Diaz? Gabby Diaz. Has six. All right, UCI rules for 600. For 600, so number three. What is the minimum length you can have your visor? I want to say four inches. Are you dribbling it? I'm checking inches. Oh. Yep, it's four inches. Yeah. Oh! Yeah. <laughs> I had it in 10, it's 10 right. centimeters. And it's I can't believe I got that. Four right. inches is 10.16 centimeters, so there you go. UCI rules 400. Why is UCI European and they clearly made that rule in inches? <laughs> no, they made it in centimeters, but I, that's why I well, didn't. Well, 0.6, you think you're telling me that they guessed <laughs> like 10.61? Um, so what did you have? 400. UCI rules. Hang on a second. His 200s are hard, so I'm just gonna avoid <laughs> that. We have two left. Um, oh, so what is the minimum size you can have your number on your back if it's a one digit? 12 inches. Not even close. What is it? Eight. Inches? Yeah. Wrong. Wrong. What was it? 10 centimeters. 10 centimeters. <laughs> <laughs> hey, anybody watching this, you guys are single digit number. Sylvan, if you're watching, please put a three this big on your back. That would be gold. <laughs> Pretty sure names are that tall. Yeah. <laughs> UCI rolls for 200. Can you grab it? What is the highest height you can have your handlebars? That's Joey the Bomb. <laughs> I wonder if it's illegal. They were, they're like 30 inches wide. You're in the gate next to it. It's like this. Well, height or width? Height. 
Width is 29. Yeah, he was for sure wide. 32. <laughs> he was very, very, very perfect. He couldn't even hold that in. Though. <laughs> yeah. Buff. Okay. Um, 9.5 inches? No. 10 inches? No. What was it? Boss, you go one more guy. I just don't, like, they don't make bars bigger than 10 inches, but some people could be running 9.25. 11 inches. No, but all wrong was 12. <laughs> you had to have 30 cent, 30.5 centimeter handlebars. Rest uh, in peace to your head when you go up the first <laughs> jump of 12 inch handlebars. <laughs> Which one was that one? Last one, 200 points for the uh, Worlds and World Championships. Who has the most Worlds and World Cups because it's combined on the website uh, finals? George Stone. <laughs> Who? Wait, what? Wait. The most World Cups and World Championship finals combined. Yes. It's yours. No. He has 37 minutes. I looked at yesterday. Who is it? They didn't update after a while. Oh, it's Laura Smoller. Oh, it's Laura. She's got like 50. She's yeah. wins every weekend. Yeah. There we go. I, I didn't want to answer that. <laughs> you can have it. Oh, you th you're that confident. Okay, we got to count. All right, so we gotta count real quick. Hunter's good at counting these big numbers. I've never seen him as this big. <laughs> see, we see who got the win. I got three two hundred and two eight hundred. I got my six hundred down to three. <laughs> I feel good. I didn't get any thousands. Oh shoot! <laughs> Donnie just texted me. Stats was his first pro bike sponsor. Really. Wait, pro? That was, hang on, that was on the website. That was 6,900. I think I won. I didn't add up. Hang on, 1,200 plus 1,600 plus. Thanks for letting me inside your house, Hey, Cam. Hello? Yo. Marco. Paul. Oh. I got 3,800. Yeah, so it says fly racing stats was from 2001 to 2002. That was the second on this list. <laughs> so, on the official Wikipedia page, which now needs to be changed, it says from 95 to 2001 he was on Power Light, and from 2001 to 2002 he was on Fly Racing Stats, 2002 to 2004 he was on Factory Phantom Avent Fly. So we need to, somebody who has been watching go update us. Johnny, if you're watching, go update your Wikipedia page. I hope you guys had fun watching this stuff. Uh, it's really important to know your history and you know respect the guys who came before you. Leave a comment down below if you guys like this. Maybe we'll get some more questions and we'll do it again. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, check out his podcast, 20 at 20. Uh, follow us all on Instagram and all that good stuff. TikTok. <laughs> <laughs>